Hello everybody, my name is Lord Batora, and welcome to this very special episode of Martha. Now, what's so special about it, you might ask? Well, the dev released an update, uh, I think it was yesterday at the time of recording, to version 2.0 of Martha, so there are some uh, changes to the game. You can even see that there's uh, the controls are now right here on the front here, and we've got, to, we can see all that stuff. And apparently they've added, a, he added a flashlight to the game, which, uh, I, I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like, uh, oh, okay, apparently it's middle click, and you get the flashlight on top of the lighter, but I feel like that'll get rid of some of the spook elements, so I'm not sure how I feel about that. I think, this is just a, my, throw this out, Dev, I know you watch, maybe add various like modes like an easy mode normal mode hard mode and then like the easy mode gives you access to the flashlight so all of us intense gamers like me who does not get scared easily ah! oh my uh can play it with uh, the lighter as the game was originally intended that's just a suggestion otherwise it whoa what's happening oh here we go oh, my computer just hitched for a second there because otherwise, it kind of feels like the the lighter doesn't really serve a whole lot of purpose in the first place. But like I said, that's just me. You know, take it or leave it type of a deal. We're going to play without the flashlight. Hello, spooky sounds. I'm used to you now. Like, I guess I can also kind of see how someone might find the lighter to get annoying after time. But, I don't know. I'm fine with it. Shush yourself! You need to stop shushing me. You don't know what you're talking about. Or even like just a, like a checkbox maybe at the start of the game that you can check. Like a enable flashlight as a starter equipment or something like that. That's an idea too. Oh, here we go. We can light this up again. Ah! Alright, but look at that. The, the candles actually light things up around a little bit more now so that's nice but so this might take a little while there's one other super special thing that i want to show you guys that piano just play on its own that's the first time i heard that see like look you can actually like see the desk that the candle is lit on oh you know what let's do one thing too let's increase this a little bit and as you see it actually kept my mouse sensitivity from last time now so he fixed that too which good on you those are all really good uh, things to address off there. And I'm sure I was the only one who influenced these changes. <laughs> Let's see. Ah! Oh my gosh! I wonder if you can hide from her at all. Not spider walk! Crap! I need to switch to my gun! Whoa! Shovel! I'm out of bullets! Okay, we got her! Holy crap! We did it! Okay! And that brings us here. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, yes. So, if anyone watching, I put in a special request for this to be done, and Affordable Cat has heated. And look at that. The jack-o'-lantern can be lit. And that makes me exceedingly happy. Behold, the lit jack-o'-lantern. It's amazing. It's incredible. Thank you so much for putting it in there. It has increased my experience of this game tremendously. You don't even understand the amount of joy I have seeing that jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> it's incredible. Thank you very much. So, let's actually try to get some uh, progress now. 
So, you're gonna get jump cut at this point. Okay, so, I found it. Over here, it went done done. I don't know how I somehow, like, never went straight from here. I've only ever, like, looked into the bathroom or something. But there was stuff moving forward over here. So, we've got... Or maybe it wasn't there before and it just became accessible now. I lit the candle, look at me, haha. <laughs> oh! A shotgun! Oh, yes! Well, let's look around first, because I get the feeling that's going to trigger some events. But yeah, there's this dead guy over here. Jack! Oh god, no, what happened to him? Okay, so we apparently know that guy. Oh, do we get another code in this one? Yep. So, the squigglies are three. Squiggly three. All right. No! Dang it! I hate you. No, no! That was the, uh, okay, so I found another problem. If you're running away and, you know, that's shift, and then inventory is tab, if I hold, if I hit shift tab, it activates the steam overlay. So, <laughs> that's a problem. Um, you might want to switch inventory to like I or something like that. Uh, that's a suggestion there, and that would fix that problem. Yeah, that's a problem if I'm trying to be fast and be like, ah, switch items, hurry up. I mean, you could disable the steam overlay, but there might be a reason someone wa might want to access that. So, here we go. We're gonna get right back into it. I really hate Martha. She scares me. <laughs> like, every time she pops up, I don't see it coming. But there's, like, always an apprehension that she's gonna pop up. So, good job on that. The overall ambiance of everything helps with that. Oh, let's light the jack-o'-lantern. <gasps> no! I hate you! I did it again! Inventory. Okay, so it does seem like the world freezes around you when you access your inventory, so that is good. And I still have my shotgun, apparently. And I do have... Did it autosave? What?! What type of weak shotgun is this?! Got her. All right. Let that out of the way. Let's keep going. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, we were in here. We discovered squiggles is three. There's another door and there's a piece of paper. I'm sorry. I did the best I could. I held out, but I didn't leave you much. I blasted that bitch with this shotgun. Seems to knock her flat, but still won't kill her. Jack. It didn't really work too well for me. <laughs> Come on, Jack. You could help out a little bit more. Come on, Jack. The stupid sounds still get me every now and then. Did that light just turn on? That's sketchy. Just a wee bit sketchy. And here's where you run away! Run through the forest! Just get out! But no, we've got a mystery to solve. We gotta solve mysteries. We don't uh, just walk away from a good old mystery when you've got one. 
even if it's cost you your life. You don't run away from a mystery. That's rule number one. Don't run away from a mystery even if it kills you. Gotta be something out here. Of course, I might have just straight up missed with the shotgun too. So that, that could be on me. Here's a car inside the walls. That's interesting. We got this shed. Are we gonna find something that I can break boards with? Oh, what's this? Pumpkins! Jack o' lanterns! Oh! -ho -ho! Can I smash the pumpkin? Nope. That's the jack o' lantern farm right there. I guess we'll try to get in here. Locked! No! What about this one? I'm looking... Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to dig up something underneath a tree, aren't I? Which tree is it? Is it this one? Aha! Yes, it is very square. I agree. There we go. You picked up the rabbit coin. Aw, oh, yeah. All right. We got the rabbit coin. We got the first of the three medallions. Yeah, where were the other ones? I'm trying to remember now. You might have to go back and check that. Does Martha attack out here? I wonder. I wonder if it's just. Can I not open this? All right. Oh my gosh, that was potential for a huge scare. But I scared myself more than anything. I saw the gas can there, and I thought it was an eye. Like some weird head thing staring up at me through that hole. That's terrifying. Oh, conceptually terrifying. Electronically locked! Come on! I'm still looking for keys for that one room. Because there's a few things that we have to unlock yet. Oh, also a key that will unlock the van. Oh, is that it? Yes! RV camper key! Alright! Alright. So Martha hasn't spawned out here, which kind of leads me to think that maybe she doesn't spawn out here. Which, would, it's a nice safe zone type idea, so I'd be okay with that. Oh, I'm so tense. Like, my, my stomach is actually, I, I recently ate a, a little while ago. And, uh, uh, it's starting to feel a little uh, because of how tense I am. Martha, no spawns. Martha, no spawns. Martha, no spawns. No spawns, Martha. No spawns, Martha. Do not show up, Martha. Don't want your kind, Martha. I do not like the way you behave. It's pretty rude. Uh, it's pretty selfish, I think. Generically speaking. Die! That wasn't there before! How could you say that to me? All I ever did was be nice, and you tell me die? Come on! That is uncalled for! Just like it was uncalled for when I broke into your house and, you know, stuff like that. But! It still doesn't mean you can- it's okay for you to tell me to die. No Marthas. Type it in the chat, everyone. I keep on calling the comment section the chat, and that is what I will forever call it, so deal with it. So, everyone in the chat, no Marthas. No Marthas. Let's put it down below. No Marthas. That is the- the chant of victory. No Marthas. You don't want to be a Martha. Come on. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's blood is written. Like, wiped out her eyes or something. In the back of my mind, I'm just like, she's gonna hop out at any second. I'm not gonna see it coming. Go whisper something else. Oh, okay, we have to collect all three. We have the rabbit coin, but apparently we need all three. Um, this lock says nine. I don't know if that counts as the first one for the safe, maybe? So maybe we only need four of the... Whisper to someone else, man! I don't care! And uh, it's fine for you to breathe and all, but you don't have to do it in my ear. Come on. Die! Why do you hate deer? Have you been playing the forest? Martha has been playing too much of the forest, man. So here's the other thing. So I don't know if it's a requirement or not to 
have all the codes, but it was a five digit code. And I found four of the code numbers, so that means the fifth one we can just do with trial and error. So that's what I'm going to try to do to see if that works. I'm just going to go to the basement if I can find that freaking basement door. Without getting martha No Marthas. No Marthas. No Marthas. Everyone at home, no Marthas. I want to hear you say it. Say it out loud. Say it proud. No Marthas. Nope, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. No, nope. Okay, I can leave the door open though. I want to go here. No Marthas. Everyone at home, no Marthas. Because here's the thing, think about this. What if Martha's behind you? No Martha, say it. You don't want Martha to get you. Ain't nobody want to get got by Martha. Everyone's got their own personal Marthas to deal with. Everyone has their... It's a metaphorical Martha and a real Martha that they have to deal with. You gotta go, no Marthas. And you gotta push that negativity away. No Marthas. Why am I down here? Oh, the safe, that's right. The safe was... The safe was not down here. The safe was in the office. Okay, let's save. Okay, version 1.0. I thought it was version 2.0. Oops. Ah! Uh, I don't like the thump thump. I don't like thump thumps. No Martha. No thump thumps. No Martha. More no Martha. If, if it keeps on thump thumping it, you know, it's... It can do that, I guess. Okay. Here we go. Now. It was three, zero... Oh, that's right. I have to use the... Oh, we've got a keypad now. Very nice. Has it always been there? Three, zero. Doritos was four. And this is where it would be random. So we'll go with one, five. Hey, I get it! It was one! Look at that! Very nice. Okay, so you don't need to have found them all. I don't know if that other one existed or if you're supposed to just be like, oh yeah, I can trial and error it at this point. But that worked out very nicely. So I've got the, the guest house and the camper. So the guest... Would that work outside? Or is that a separate room? Was there any locked rooms in the house? I don't remember. Save! Save me from Martha! I suppose I could go out to the RV. I'm just really scared of the RV. After that kid was like, Woo! Last time. <gasps> no! So can this shotgun only have one? Okay, it can have two. I just have to reload it manually twice. There we go. Aha! Get wrecked! What? Come on! What type of weak shotgun is this? Ow! Shovel time! Dang it! I'm in the corner! Dodge! Oh, I survived! Oh my gosh, I can't see anything though, I'm so covered in blood. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh no. Martha! You guys weren't no Marthaing, were you? You were being quiet and just watching. You're supposed to be saying, no Martha, and you didn't. I know this to be true, because Martha attacked me. Come on, guys. What, do you want me to die, huh? Oh, I can, oh, the blood all over my face. It'd be nice if I could, like, wash that off. Ah! Whisper in someone else's ear, don't care, man. Come on. Oh, I need a med kit. 
Come on, spooky children. Come on, spookies. Don't you? Oh, ha 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 ha. Yep. So funny. Any med kits? Med kits? Lock number nine. Oh, okay, so apparently there's a code for something else. Med, med kits. Can I use that toilet paper to wipe the blood off my face? Lighter, come on! Please, lighter, son! Picked up the blue fuse. All right! Get the electricity going. All right. To whoever finds this, we locked ourselves up in the camper van outside. That thing seems to be confined to the property. We slept in the guest house last night, but feel safer out here. Emily is a lost cause. She is now in the power of something else. The guilt eats away at me, but I had to do it. I boarded her up in that room. None of the cars work. We are heading out on foot and hope it does not follow. If you find this, please help us. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. So, I found a combination lock in there. No med kits. So, um, yeah, this is, this is great. <clears throat> Oh boy, got the green fuse. Um, I would recommend, even if you're at, you're at low health, to eventually make the blood go away from your face because it's actually pretty difficult to do anything. And it actually hits the point where it's actually kind of annoying. Like maybe keep like the overlay around the center, like red so you can tell that you're like about to die, but not so much just covering the screen. Over here. There we go. Do I... Did that, like, power on some stuff, or do I need two of them to do that? Oh, oh, wait, I probably have to... The blue fuse is probably in the guest room. Which is... Maybe it's the attic, because I have all the keys, it looks like. <sighs> oh, boy. I'm so tense. Because I know the next time she pops up... Yeah, I'm next. I am next. I agree. I know the next time I pop up, I'm screwed, because I'm out of bullets... And I I don't have a gun. Uh, you're you're going to take damage back if you're hitting her with the shovel, and I can only take like one more hit. What? Hmm. Well, what's the guest key? This is I need something to break this with. Shovel is not good enough. What the crap? Why did you yell at me? Oh, okay, the music just didn't... All right. <laughs> music didn't start for that one. Okay, well, that's all the time we have for this video. So, we made a little progress. We found some keys. We found a fuse. Gotta find the guest house. And, uh, boy, is it gonna be difficult to survive. I might have spent too much time wandering around looking for stuff and I ended up using like all my bullets. So who knows, we might actually have to start a new game or something. Epic 2.0, I love the jack-o'-lantern. There's optimizations and other bug fixes, which I did notice. There's lights going on, it actually illuminates stuff. They added the flashlight, the controls are on the front and the settings are saved. There, I think there might've been a couple more things, but that's covering most of it. So way to go affordable. He's still sticking with this game. He's updating the game. If you guys are interested in the game, if this looks interesting to you, it was like four or five bucks on Steam. You know, go help him out. It's an independent developer. He's making the game by himself. So can't wait to see it even further down the road. So with that, I hope you have an excellent day, night, whatever time you're watching this. Bye-bye.